Obviously, I used to seeing um, DJing videos and everything like that, but um, what I'm doing now is I'm showing you something <clears throat> that's a bit of a project. It's still to do with with sound and equipment, but not as you would think in the DJing business. Uh, if you're not aware, we we do I do property maintenance and things like that, but as like hobbies and stuff like that, it's it's more to do with cars and. Uh, basically modifying them, doing what, whatever needs to be done. But today, what we've got here is a cubby box for a Land Rover. Now this will be placed between the seats, the passenger and the driver's side, and basically you've got a cubby box. But what we'll be doing is lifting it five inch, five, six inch up, so that it's higher up for the armrest. We'll also be installing this, which is a um, cigarette lighters and USB ports with a voltage meter on that will be going in there. And there will also be in this box underneath, once it's built, a six and a half inch subwoofer, which will look completely different and bespoke for the Land Rover. So what will so what I intend to do is I will take some photos of all the bits that need to go in which we, you will see next in the next part and then you, in the series you will see this being built and put together and hopefully you will like what you see at the end but for now you'll just have to wait a few minutes because this will go on a few minutes yes okay right it's me burping pardon me <laughs> Basically, as you can see by the photos, we've now made the box unit, which is this here. Quite simple to make. It's just basically strips of wood making a box formation. As you can see, I've cut windows out here and here. And you've got the mounting for the speaker, which is here. This is a, this is a Vibe speaker, 600 watt RMS, which is the peak power it will go to. It will comfortably go around about 200 watts constantly. So that's ideal for this unit, which will go inside the hole there, like so. Now this is going to be carpeted with acoustic carpet to uh, make it look a lot neater and a lot nicer, and then it will all fit onto the box like so so you've got one complete unit raised up so that you can put your arm on it while you're driving and you'll have a nice sound coming out of the bottom there so yeah I'll just pop that one back up there for now what I have done bought some perspex here to make the windows with and these are for the side bits here so I've cut them to size ready to go in once it's carpeted they'll be fixed in but on this one I have engraved the Land Rover logo on the other side which Once that's inside there, you can just make out Land Rover. Right, so now there'll be some lights going inside there, so it'll all be illuminated so you can see the speaker, and that engraving there will show up a lot prouder with the light behind it. So it'll look pretty cool, pretty neat, definitely bespoke, and one of a kind, as I would say. So, yeah, we'll 
get on with this now and in the next video you should see it all nice done and completed Stage one completed of the build of the uh, the uh, subwoofer unit that's going underneath the cubby box, and all it needs to do now, which will be in part two, is to fit it into the Land Rover and wire everything up. Uh, the subwoofer is now fitted. I've carpeted it, as you've seen by the photos, using carpet spray, sharp knife, and some scissors. It's quite good carpet that I've got. It's uh, quite thick. There it is. Good, decent uh, thing there, as you can see by that, it still lifts up, it'll all screw together. I've put my light behind it so you can see what's going to happen with the lights. You'll see the lettering light up and you'll also see the lettering in the uh, actual base unit. There you go. There's the subunit and as you can see the first bits all the way around just a few marks on it, a bit of dust come off, fine. Yeah, there you go, the Land Rover base box unit which will go over the cubby unit. Like I said, in the next video you will see it all wired up and working in the Land Rover. So keep watching and don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. Thanks for watching.